As people head onto grass, and particularly high digestible grass, lush grass, and this normally occurs in early to mid-April, people can come across a milk fat depression. And essentially what happens is that there's, there's a whole lot of activity in the rumen. Uh, you're getting a touch of subclinical uh, rumen acidosis and, uh, and a touch of strong acidosis as well, which results in less digestible fiber, less fiber digestion. Um, so you're finding dungs loosen up, you're finding uh, the acidity level in the rumen is, is, is increasing, the cow is not chewing enough, the cud enough, not ruminating enough, and as a consequence of all this then you're getting lower milk butter fats. So what we do with it with uh, buffer fat 14 is we include yeast in it. Yeast is there to uh, improve rumen fermentation, to encourage intake and uh, and we include acid buff as well. Acid buff is a high intensity buffer which has been proven in trials by UCD to increase the, uh, the pH in the rumen so the animal doesn't get acidic so you do not have this, this drop in, uh, in um, in the rumen pH and consequently then you improve fiber digestion which allows you to uh, increase your milk fats and uh, avoid the milk fat syndrome depression. Um, so essentially within buffer fat 14 it's a high protein it's a 14% protein feed it's a high in protected starch coming from maize high in digestible fiber it has a high level of yeast sac live yeast included it has a high level of acid buff included and it has the CalMag and Miller's included in two and a half kilos. So it's a key product uh, to avoid and solve uh, milk fat depression that can arise in, in April. So for further information, please contact your local Glombia representative or glombiaconnect.com.